You're watching TV 21 News. Disaster update. Special fallout report. Twenty-one days ago, at approximately 12 o'clock noon, Eastern Seaboard Time, the coordinated explosion of the worldwide network of nuclear devices brought to an end the devastating global pandemic. No official study of the ecosphere has yet been undertaken. We are now awaiting a public statement from the authorities. Local security chiefs say that some food depots are vulnerable to looting. Unauthorized personnel seen entering such facilities will be met with ultimate force. Genetically fabricated dried food substitutes like that used by astronauts in orbit will be supplied by disaster management teams until such time as stockpiles run out. Disaster management coordinator, Buck Bender. Any living thing not protected by fallout bunkers, if not already dead, will soon die in radiation sickness, exposure, or starvation. Radiation levels remain high. Public safety cannot be assured. Experts suggest that no more than a few minutes outside should be risked. Despite the warnings, some people have chosen to venture outside. They all have personal reasons for venturing beyond their shelters but must be warned. Anything held for even short periods could be highly radioactive. Do not eat or drink anything found outside.